For more than five hours, the astronauts hung above the Earth carrying out emergency repairs. It's rare for a spacewalk to be organised at such short notice. On Thursday, the crew noticed white flakes falling from the International Space Station. It was quickly discovered the source was a leak of ammonia from a cooling system. The crew was never in danger, but the repair deemed absolutely necessary. We spun up uh, what we call a Team 4 effort, which is um, pretty much bringing everybody to the table that we can to help pull together uh, um, every piece of information that we need to be able to go execute something like this. US astronauts Chris Cassidy and Tom Marshburn were tasked with taking out the old pump and putting the new one in place. With that done, and mission control engineers monitoring every step on the ground, the astronauts were told to watch for leaks as the pump was restarted. We're going to turn the pump um, system back on with you guys watching and we'll see what we can see. After just over 30 minutes, they sent back the message the operation was a success. No snow. Yeah, we uh, copy no snow. NASA was pleased with the way things have turned out. Uh, we didn't see any obvious sign of a leak, but it's going to take some time. It'll take some weeks for us to look at the system, evaluate the system, and, and make sure we, we did indeed uh, stop the leak. The pump had been in place since November 2000, but this area on the space station is prone to leaks. These same two astronauts carried out a spacewalk in the exact same spot during a shuttle visit in 2009. Engineers will now try to work out what caused the leak, if it was a faulty seal or even a micrometeor strike. Alan Fisher, Al Jazeera.